all sorts of organisms actually survive in the desert or in the Arctic Circle where they can survive for hundreds of years and shrink down and preserve their DNA, RNA cells and proteins. With a drop of water, a rain or humidity in the air, they come back to life. It's hard to believe, but this strange looking organism called a tardigrade is behind new technology revolutionizing how biological samples are handled. There are little organisms like tardigrades or like brine shrimp, the sea monkeys that you can get in the, the kids' toy store. There are lots of organisms that do that. Well, we've taken that idea and created a synthetic chemistry that allows us to do that in the laboratory. Let's look at the data. Biomatrica, a San Diego-based company founded by Dr. Rolf Mueller and Dr. Judy mueller Cohn, have used the principle of anhydrobiosis to help store blood, vaccines, DNA, and even protein at room temperature. It will be important for research and development, biopharmaceutical industry, vaccine development, blood storage, uh, forensics, uh, for everybody who works with biological samples. Dr. Rolf Mueller says the concept is similar to shrink wrapping and it may eliminate the need for cold storage. Freezer storage is such a very difficult endeavor. It's very costly, a lot of energy which is uh, wasted on freezers in order to keep it at very, very low temperatures. All the companies who have to store these samples use freezers in order to do that. For them, it's a huge cost. And this innovation can be applied to almost any industry that handles samples, potentially cutting costs involved with long-term storage of biological samples, all while maintaining sample integrity. There's a huge potential loss if someone loses their samples due to a freezer breakdown. A simple concept derived from nature to take us literally from the ice age into the new age. You're eliminating the cost and the organization of having to dig through frozen over freezers to find your samples is eliminated as well.